So I can talk in a little bit more detail about uh, like what our framework actually does. Mm -hmm. So I guess some core pieces of functionality that we try and cover are, mm -hmm. for example, um, a lot of developers coming into kind of social applications, maybe they're used to a different model like Facebook, which is more like traditional web application development. Mm -hmm. And they're, they're wondering about, well, where's my pagination? Mm -hmm. Like, where's kind of a basic paradigm like that, right? right? right. And so our framework handles like um, in having individual pages as a concept. Okay. So they're continuing to kind of work on a model that they're familiar with. Okay. And the framework will handle pagination, which might actually be implemented differently depending on the container. Okay. Right, in terms of how you link from page to page and stuff like that. Okay. Um, another core piece of functionality that's kind of abstracted out, like I was saying, is um, you know there are a lot of small implementation differences. Mm -hmm. Like certain module prefs have to be specified in one container, not in another. Okay. Um, there are core kind of lifecycle type events which you know are, are making it into zero point eight, right. but currently the different containers implement differently. Wow. Um, so you know we try and abstract those things out. You, you, so you really have a like a high high level library kind of thing, taking care of all the quirkiness of each right. container. Right. <laughs> exactly. So I mean, it's almost like on the, for the application gadget XMLs, right. we have kind of what amounts to a simple code generation framework right. to handle kind of those differences, right? Um, because what an application developer wants to focus on is that they want to focus on you know these are the key pieces of functionality for the app, right? Mm -hmm. You know, this is the page that I, I send a gift on. This is the page that you know represents the profile, et cetera, et cetera. They don't want to think about well, you know, on high five, I need to do this JavaScript call to, to right. navigate pages versus you know this one on, on a different container. Right. Um, so that's one side of it. Okay. Um, the other side is on the server side, on the back end. Uh, you know, one question that everyone has is like, well, how do you handle the differences where it really matters and the messaging and the mm -hmm. flows? Mm -hmm. Like Josh said, you know, a lot of these applications. Even though they're in the same space and they share a lot of the basically the same content, right? Mm -hmm. They actually work very differently because mm -hmm. the messaging kind of channels are different on each mm -hmm. container. Um, in fact, it's different to the point where you know, as you know, like on Orkut, for example, there's no REST API right. for doing some of the messaging. Whereas on High Five, um, that might be the best way to do things in many cases. And so, what we've tried to do is actually construct a model of server-side events for most of, to control most of our flows and messaging. Um, so that allows us to, to keep, uh, you know, our gadget XML somewhat free mm -hmm. of these types of decisions. And on the server side, we can generate these server side events in like application code, which can then be processed by specific event processors that are appropriate for the container that the user is currently running on. Mm -hmm. So from application developer, it actually, you know, um, that abstraction makes it much more conceptually simple. Like. You know, when I say on Super Pets, mm -hmm. I pet someone's pet, that's mm -hmm. considered like a server side event. Mm -hmm. Now, what happens because of that is going to differ a lot depending on which container I'm running on. And that might happen server side, or it might even happen client side, okay. right? Because that event might trigger something to happen on the client side. So to your application developer, it's the same thing. Right, so for, right, in terms of developing the core framework, it's the right. same thing. Okay. And then they can focus on, well, what happens on Pi 5? Right. Oh, well, what happens on you know MySpace or what happens on Orkin? And it's like a, it's a separate abstraction. So. Right, right. 